Hey guys, George here. It's uh, Christmas Eve and we're working on the new Turbo Ace Matrix and uh, this is a build for uh, Matt in New Jersey and it's not finished yet. I'm almost done with it, but I'm just getting installed the electronics now. We're going to go with NASA V2 uh, Dragon Link system and uh, my this uh, I got this uh, Turbo Ace Matrix from wowhobbies.com and my initial uh, review is, is outstanding quality for the price. It seems a, a little on the expensive side, but the quality is really there. Uh, this is a 6S, this is a 6S quadcopter, about an, eight, about an 800 size. Um, it's, it's really got a nice uh, span and it's actually a foldable design where the arms do fold back. You simply have these uh, thumb screws to loosen up. And the arms fold back along with the landing gear. The landing gear travels with the arms. And it makes it, uh, it, makes it really nice and portable. So let's go through a few of the features. Uh, first of all, it's got three decks on it. This has an isolation system for uh, a camera isolation system. We're going to put a brushless gimbal on here. Uh, it does have three decks. The, the top deck isn't on yet. All the electronics are going to be inside when it's finished. Um, I'm going to put an, a full FPV system on there, DJI OSD. It has the NASA V2. I'm going to put a Dragon Link uh, long range system on it. And uh, these are 400 kV motors that come with the kit. Um, so it is a 6S system. They only have 400 kV. 15 inch carbon fiber props are included, which I have right here. And uh, my initial, uh, you know, uh, Opening the box up, everything was really nicely organized. Um, all the screws were in their, their in their each bag, with uh, and everything was labeled. So the lower deck had its own screws, the middle deck had its own screws, the landing gear had its own screws. Everything was labeled really nicely. Uh, the isolation deck it was in its own bag. Um, the motors and everything was packaged really good. It's it's a beautiful fiber or a beautiful carbon fiber construction. There wasn't any blemishes on it whatsoever. Um, one thing, they do not give you any extra screws or standoffs. The number they give you is the exact number you're gonna need. Um, so that's one thing to keep in mind is that uh, you don't have any extra standoffs. And um, it went together pretty easily. It took, uh, it took about four hours to get it uh, this far, uh, but the video tutorials they have online are really good. Um, and I'll see if I can give you guys a closer look here. Okay. And I'll show you the detail on the frame. It really is a nice frame. Uh, you know, a little on the pricey side, but the, the quality seems to be there. These arms aren't like the, uh, isn't like the aluminum you guys buy at Lowe's. This is really, really thick. Uh, thick walled aluminum. Um, one thing I wasn't crazy about is each motor only has two screws, but they do use uh, lock washers, and I even put just a dab of uh, just a dab of uh, thread lock on those on those screws. All of the standoffs, uh, metal and metal, obviously have uh, you know thread lock in them. And the only thing that's down in the bottom plate is if I can hold it up is the speed controllers which they're sort of sliding around right now, but the, their heat sinks are, are in the open outside, so they get some air. And uh, even these uh, landing gear legs, they, they adjust too. So you can move the arms in and out to a uh, full open position. Um, so, so the main electronics are separate from the control system electronics. FPV will go on this deck. And then at the end, the top plate will fit on there nicely. And uh, there it is, and we'll get it open back up here, give you an idea. And there it is opened up. 
and uh, it's real easy. I like the thumb screws, uh, and there's thumb screws on the inside of landing gear. They can flex too with hard landings. They can travel down. You don't have to worry about breaking them. Um, it comes with an XT90 for a battery, and it also comes with a uh, multiple power cable. This is going to go into the DJI system, this XT60, and this one will be for the FPV system. So uh, it's a really nice kit, guys. Comes with the motors, speed controllers, carbon fiber frame, um, and the one thing you do have to order is uh, none of the other electronics, just the motors and speed controllers, the only electronics included in the kit. But it's really built well. It's a it's a really nice size. Um, the main the the length of this main frame here is about two feet long, just to give you guys an idea of really how big this is. Uh, this table's I think uh, four feet wide, and we're just under we're just under uh, we're we're at about three feet uh, going across uh, horizontally. So um, this is the uh, Turbo Ace Matrix. Be sure to go to Wah Hobbies and check it out, guys. And as always, if you have any questions, just ask and uh, check out the time-lapse video I'm going to put up next. Thanks for watching, guys. Merry Christmas.